Good morning, guys. It's actually sort of almost lunchtime. <laughs> I've just been editing my sports girl video all, all morning. I went to Pilates this morning. Now, I've finished the majority of that, but I've just got a little bit to go, and then I'm going to um, put it through handbrake and get it all set up. Oh, it started raining outside. I'm gonna go get myself a salad from Fresh Blend and a coffee, but it started raining outside and I don't really wanna walk in the rain. Maybe I'll wait. <laughs> I'm gonna do my sister's makeup because it's her formal today. And then I'm going to the AFL, maybe, if it stops raining. I'm not going if it's raining. I got my skipping rope out, because we've been doing skipping with our boxing sessions at the gym, and I really love skipping. I'm really enjoying the cold weather at the moment, putting hoodies on and really just cozying up, because it makes editing really fun. What else was, oh my God, I didn't even realize Gidget was there. <laughs> I found my other quote book. This is from Kiki K as well, like the one I showed you in the last vlog. I thought I would read you a quote from this one. If you have good thoughts, they will shine out of your face like sunbeams and you will always look lovely. You can always tell when a person is a really nice, genuine, caring person because they've got this warmth about them. I just always aspire to be and always want people to think of me. I want to radiate warmth and so if you're a really nice caring kind compassionate person you'll instantly just look lovely do you guys like my random cowgirl hoodie i don't think it's mine <laughs> i've never seen it before in my life very gloomy cloudy day it's very cold today isn't it little bean hey hey you want some food yeah yes please Say hi to the camera. Yeah. Love you, little bam bam. Give you, you want some food? Yay! Yay! Got my Thai salad and my coffee. So I got this delivery from Zala Hair, and I really want to try put them on. I, I'm hoping these ones are a little bit shorter than the other ones I have. A brush, some clips. And I think this is what you keep the hair in, which is kind of cool. That's a really, really pretty length, but I think it might be a little too dark because as you can see, my hair is quite blonde. I'm going to try them anyway. <laughs> okay, so I've just put them in. They're not the exact perfect color. They're so fun. It's really cool that you can just like change your look up. So now that I've made the effort to put extensions in, I'm going to start filming. So I'm going to do my Princess Polly haul now. Okay, so I've just finished filming my haul. This is the aftermath of my haul. It's just laying all laid out on my bed. So I don't know if this video will be going up before or after the haul. Either way, one of them will be up on th this Sunday and then one of them will be up Wednesday. It's probably one of my favorite hauls I've ever filmed just because it's a really good variety of stuff. Like it has some makeup, some jewelry, some glasses, clothes, summer, winter, bit of everything. So yes, if that is already up, I will link it in my description box. So yes, now I'm gonna go downstairs and get an afternoon snack and go help mum set up for the party. Poor mum has been slaving away for Jessica because Jessica's having an after party for her formal with my sister. So mum's been organizing heaps of stuff with her. So I'll go downstairs and help them set up and then I've got to do Jessica's makeup. So I'll show you guys the little setup. It's quite cool actually. They've cleared the lounge room and I think this is gonna be a dance space. Oh, and some food that I'm going to be eating. I'll eat it all before they come. What do you think? Sure. <laughs> and then this is the marquee outside. Do you like my extensions, Mom? And then this is the marquee. How cool is this? So basically there's like a little wooden floor. And as you can see, it's cleared up beautifully. So Jessica's very lucky that it's very nice weather. And then this is a nice little sitting area for everyone to come and hang. Oh, there's Gigi. You're gonna party hard tonight. Gigi and I are gonna have a dance later. I'm just tricking everyone with non-alcoholic champagne. Tricky mum. <laughs> mum loves going to her manly freezers. Um, it's a place where you can buy everything in bulk, so you can get a whole bunch of lollies and stuff in huge packets, and it's a lot cheaper. So, if you guys are from Sydney, manly freezers is really good for parties. I'm just gonna be here at the lolly table. Well, I came downstairs to help mum set up, but she look, looks like she's already, already kind of there. What can I help you with, Mandy? She doesn't want to be in the video. <laughs> I can go get Katie. I can go get Katie. Okay. Can go get Katie. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're from school now. What time yeah. is it? 
Yeah, okay, I'll go get her. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna go get my sister and then I will probably start filming again when I do Jessica's makeup. So I'll show you guys her before and after and stuff. Yoink. So now I'm just home, just picked up Kate and then now I'm about to do Jessica's makeup. So I'll do a bit of a before and after. Probably won't film the whole thing just cause this vlog's already gonna be so long. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get the stairs. I'll show you guys what I do for her base just because she's got kind of textured skin and I'll show you what primers and stuff I'll use for that. Textured skin, like a little bit drier. Yeah. So yeah, let's see, I'll just put it here. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with the Marc Jacobs Coconut Primer just because her skin is very dry. I'll just get you to put it on. It's just a moisturizer. Her skin's very dry, so you just want to make sure you're moisturizing it really well. Otherwise, you know, the skin will be quite flaky. Now I'm going to take the Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. This one's more of a smoothing primer, so it'll fill in any of her pores and smooth out any of the texture on her skin. So I'm just going to put a bit of this all over her skin. Mask? Mm -hmm. We'll let that sink in now and then I'm gonna go in with I'm gonna go in with the Marc Jacobs Remarkable foundation on her because it's full coverage um, But you don't need that much of it so I can spread it out quite evenly on her skin But I'll probably mix this with a little bit of the coconut Primer as well just to thin it out a little bit because it because it is so thick And I'm gonna use a beauty blender to blend that into her skin as well because that'll make the most flawless finish You don't want to start with too much because it'll really get quite cakey, so you want to build it up. And I'm matching her foundation to her neck because she's got a spray tan. I'm going to go ahead and just do the rest of her makeup off camera and then I'll show you guys the after. Okay, so before... <laughs> So here's an after, as you can see it's nice flawless skin, not too over the top, but then we've just gone for a really nice bronzy eye and some half lashes. Looking good. Whoa, orange lighting. I decided to give the AFL a skip today, it's just so cold and rainy and I just knew that I probably wasn't going to enjoy it very much. So. Instead, I am sitting here editing. It's now 7 p.m. I'm just editing and Katie's chilling up here while we wait for the afters. Now I'm just watching MasterChef. The people, the kids are coming, the kids are coming back. They're all coming back from the afters at like 11.30, so we've got to stay up till then so that we can confiscate any alcohol. Get lit, yeah. This weekend is the long weekend, so I'm going out to dinner tomorrow night and then I've got drinks on Saturday, so I thought it'd be best just to have a chilled one tonight because it is only Thursday, so. And I've got to film a video tomorrow, a try on haul. I will probably leave the vlog here. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I know it's just another little daily vlog. I will see you guys in my next video.